something that you often speak to that I mm -hmm. have found really helpful to share with clients is like that we have to give ourselves all the grace to do this imperfectly because it is something that like in the beginning can feel overwhelming. And you talk a lot about mm -hmm. like, write it down say like, I'm going to bring a piece of paper into this conversation with me because I get flooded. And I feel like that's been such a helpful tool to share with people. But the other thing I remember a therapist gave me early on was like, you can yep, yep. kind of make something up if like saying I'm flooded and I'm overwhelmed feels even confronting because sometimes in the beginning that feels like, Make like <laughs> she gave me permission to be like, yeah. oh, you know what, mom, someone's at the door. Let me call you right back. Like literally, like if it feels like too much, make up an excuse. Like who cares? Like and whatever, maybe don't lie. <laughs> That's not going to lie with your values. But I'm just saying like you can say, oh, you know what? Something just came up. Let me let me come right back to this or whatever in a way that feels safe for you, I guess, is my point. Because to Vanessa's point, a lot of this, like when we are in the actual experience of overwhelm in our body, like the self-regulation required to say, I am flooded. I don't know mm -hmm. how to do this. Like we do need mm -hmm. sometimes tools to actually grasp onto to stay in our body first because that can feel overwhelming. Mm 